Sergeant Snake here. Put on your domes and buckle your chin straps, cause Gunny Highway says so. In this installment of Marine Corps Movie Heritage, we'll be discussing Heartbreak Ridge, a movie about a lonely old warrior whose time is nearly up and has to spend his final tour whipping some punks into recon marines. For those of you who are unfamiliar, recon marines are the tactical tip of the spear for a marine expeditionary unit, or MU. Back to the movie. Overall, I love this movie. First of all, Gundy reminds me of a platoon sergeant I had, keeping us up for 36 hours of cleaning just because he felt like it. Second, this is easily the most quotable Clint Eastwood movie of all time. And third, this is an accurate portrayal of certain realities in a peacetime military, such as a commanding officer more concerned with request forms and at odds with a fighting man's marine. Also, a platoon full of bums with attitudes. My favorite quote of this movie? I eat concertina wire and piss napalm. A bad dude, indeed. Ultimately, the movie leads our misfit recon devil dogs into Grenada. In real life, Operation Urgent Fury took place in 1983 when the island of Grenada fell to a coup which placed American lives in danger. Marines, Rangers, the 82nd Airborne, Delta Force, and Navy SEALs were all sent in in order to seize control back until elections could be held. I strongly recommend this movie. Before we part, let me tell you about K-Pot Coffee, named for the helmet worn by myself, and for the helmet worn by our troops in battle. K-Pot Coffee is a delicious gourmet blend that's designed to raise money for charities. So go down to the description box below this video and click on the first link to find K-Pot Coffee on Amazon. Otherwise, share us, subscribe, and look for the next video. Yes, missed.